Along the road ahead lies something you need. However, in order to claim it, you must lose something that is dear to you. Stay asleep. Huh? Who's there? You should remain asleep. Here, between light and dark. Between what? Oh. Huh? The king! Where's the king? Together we close the door to darkness. After that? You came drifting here by yourself. You did not have the strength to overcome the darkness. Or, maybe you were close to it. <laughs> As if I'm some kind of demon. <laughs> Turn from the light. Shut your eyes. Here, blanketed by the darkness, sleep is safety. Sleep is eternal. But... What's this? It is a door to the truth. Take it and your sleep ends as you take the first step toward the truth. But know this. The truth will bring you pain. Will you still go? There is no return to the security of sleep. This seemed like a boring place to take a nap anyway. That was very well said, Riku. Ah! Truth, huh? Hey, you think it's okay to barge in? But we gotta do it if we're gonna find the king. The king? King Mickey's here? Something just told me he'd be here, okay? 
Really? Because now that you mention it, I was kind of thinking the same thing. Seriously? Me too. One look at this castle, and I just knew. Our very best friends. They're here. <laughs> yep. Guess great minds think alike. Wait, hey, hold on. It can't be just a coincidence. Oh, no, Kimmy. You don't mean that. Yep, I had it too. Mm hmm I had the exact same feeling. Gorge! Maybe it's contagious! No, no! Something screwy! We gotta go take a look! All right. Where, where are you going? That way. To the door. <laughs> are you scared? Ah, oh, don't be ridiculous! Come on, let's go, Goofy! Hey, fellers, uh, shouldn't we shut the door behind us before we go? Sora! That's it. Who are you? Well, I was. Oh, yeah? I'll try some magic. Sega! Come on. Sega! Sega! Come on, Sligan! Fire! Why is it a button? I should think it's obvious. The moment you set foot in this castle, you forgot every spell and every ability you ever knew. In this place, to find is to lose, and to lose is to find. That is the way in Castle Oblivion. Castle Oblivion? Here you will meet people that you have known in the past, and you will meet people you miss. I miss? Riku! You mean Riku's here? If what you want is to find him, What'd you do? I merely sampled your memories, and from them, I made this. To reunite with those you hold dear. What's this? A card? It is a promise for the reunion you seek. Hold the card to open the door, and beyond it a new world. Proceed, Sora, to lose and claim anew, or to claim anew only to lose. Oh. Come on, let's go. Don't I even warrant a hello, Lexius? What is going on here, Zexion? I want an explanation. Nice to see you too, Vexen. It's such a shame. The organization used to be the rope that bound us together. You're only number six. How dare you? Let it go, Vexen. Zexion, tell us. What did you detect? Visitors. I picked up two scents in the castle's lowest basement. One of them was Maleficent. Don't be absurd. The witch is gone. She cannot return from the realm of darkness of her own volition. 
If you would let me finish. The scent belonged not to the real Maleficent, but to a very convincing double. But I truly cannot say much beyond that, since the double is no more. Our other visitor saw to that. And who is it? I do not know for sure. But the scent was very similar to that of the Superior. And yet, not exactly the same, was it? This truly piques my curiosity. Now, what to do? We wait. See what develops. Well, Sora, did you enjoy meeting your memories? Yeah, it was good to see everyone. But what do you really want from me? What do you have to give? <laughs> Hello! <laughs> what do you want? No hog in the hero. Then perhaps you'd like to test him. Perhaps I would. My show now, Keyblade Master. Who am I? Oh, my name's Axel. Got it memorized? Uh, sure. Good. You're a quick learner. So, Sora, now that we're getting to know each other better... You go off and die on me now. Why do you Why shun the darkness? <laughs> Come on, I know you heard me. Every word I said to Maleficent. Darkness is your weapon. It is time you learned you must accept it. What do you mean? Stop resisting. Accept the darkness. You have no choice. If you are to serve me again, 
I thought it was you, Ansem. Oh, you don't seem surprised. All you have been talking about is the darkness. I can only assume you want to pull me back in so you can play puppet master. Clever boy. I knew you'd be the one to most appropriately serve me. And now, surrender to me again. You're crazy! Not a chance! Did you really think you could do me harm? A weakling like you couldn't even defeat Sora, and you had darkness on your side. Uh, oh. Oh, excuse me for being weak. You are weak. You need darkness. Surrender. Bow to darkness. Bow to me. That's not gonna happen. Only the darkness can offer to you all of the strength that you will need. You're wrong. Oh. That voice. Your Majesty? That's right. Remember, Riku, you're not alone. Listen close. The light will never give up on you. You'll always find it, even in the deepest darkness. I got it. I won't lose to darkness. Not today. You think that feeble little light can save you from the darkness that I command? Another one? What's it do? Hmm. Kind of looks like the card you used. When you made Traverse Town. Then I guess we're gonna need it to keep going. That's right. <gasps> Action! Did you really think after that introduction, I would give up oh so easily? You were testing us. And you passed. Congratulations, Sora. You're ready now. Ready to take on Castle Oblivion. You will need to follow your memories. Trust what you remember and seek what you forget. Then you will find someone very special. You mean King Mickey and Riku? <laughs> you will just have to give some more thought to who it is that's most important to you. Our most precious memories lie so deep within our hearts that they're out of reach. But I'm sure that you can find yours, Sora. Why me? You have lost sight of the light within the darkness, and it seems that you've forgotten that you forgot. The light within... darkness? Would you like me to give you a hint? Sora, do you need it? I'm gonna figure it out for myself. If you're in my way... Don't worry, Sora. We'll protect you. <laughs> Good answer. Just what I'd expect from the Keyblade Master. But be forewarned. When your sleeping memories awaken, you may no longer be who you are now. What? That all you got? It seems to me that you are intent on resisting the darkness. All right, then see it for yourself. This is a card crafted from your memory. Advance through the world it creates, and soon you will understand. Chasing after light is not the way. It will not give you distance from the darkness. 
There is no running from the darkness. Don't worry, I'm not running. Give it. I'll enter the world, and in the end, if I haven't given in to the darkness, then I win. I have one more gift for you. What'd you do? I simply tempered the darkness that yet remains in your heart. You still think that I'd rely on darkness? To use it or not is your choice. I'll be waiting, Riku. For you to sense it, and yield to the darkness in your heart. What's wrong, Jiminy? Well, you see, what Axel said back there worries me. What could he have meant by, you may no longer be who you are? I may no longer be me. How can I be anyone else? <laughs> of course. Still, you can't be too careful. Yep. Feels like just about anything could happen here in Castle Obliv-y, Obliv-y, uh, Obliv the Oh, yeah. Now I remember. We'll be okay. Whatever it is they're cooking up, we'll be able to handle it together. Of Course we will. Like that creepy castle we explored together. The one with all those weird contraptions. Mm, when was that? Uh, I can't remember. What was it, Todd? Gorge. Oh, it was, uh, Holla... Holly? Holler? Sorry, I can't remember. What? Stop goofing around. Goofy, sure you didn't make it up? Oh, I don't think so. Something smells funny. What's that scent? It's so familiar. <gasps> darkness. It's the smell of darkness. <sighs> I can't believe this is happening. The darkness even seeped into my skin. Don't worry, Riku. <gasps> Your Majesty! can see right through you. Funny, huh? I can only send a bit of my power to this place. That's why I've got a request for you. Request? Listen, Riku. Just because darkness holds you, don't let go of who you are. You've got to fight the darkness inside you. It won't be easy to do, I know. But please don't forget. Even in the darkest darkness, there's always a little bit of light. Light within darkness. You and I have seen it. The far welcoming light inside the door to darkness. The light of Kingdom Hearts. It will show you the way. Please don't give up. Believe in the light. That's a request from my heart. Okay. I'll do my best. Trust me, I'll try to find a way to reach you. I'll get there. I promise. Oh. You're an illusion. Don't worry. We shook hands in our hearts, remember? We're connected, you and me. Guess we are. Hmm. Huh? What's the 
Nevada. It's that creepy castle that I was talking about earlier. I know I didn't imagine it. Cause that was the castle where Sora had to use the Keyblade to free Kyrie's heart. Then he just disappeared. And I was so worried. How could I ever forget that? Oh, it was when I turned into a Heartless. Wait, that happened... in a castle? Ah, uh, you forgot that? Cause I remember both of you. Then what's it called? That's easy, it was. Somebody help me if you get your corner. Every word. I finished the first volume right before we got to this castle. Now then, if I can just find it... Oh, <laughs> here we go. Let's have a look. Oh, how could it be? What's the matter? Oh, my entries, they're gone. Every page is blank. What do we do? How could this have happened? I'm so careful with the journals. <laughs> All that hard work is gone. The journal's blank. What's going on? I have identified the scent. It is Riku. Riku, you say? Has he emerged from the realm of darkness? His existence, it was once doubled in the darkness. Fascinating. That's why you mistook him for the superior. The dark power given to Riku facilitated his escape from its realm. What I want to know is, why he appeared here in Castle Oblivion? That's really quite simple. His existence resonates with that of another hero. Sora is in the castle? He arrived earlier. Marluxia is already using Namine's unique powers to meddle with Sora's heart. Without even bothering to consult us. It seems he desperately wants the Keyblade Master for himself. What a foolish plan indeed. Sora's is not such an interesting existence. The entity that holds true value is Riku, the hero of darkness. I take it you're Riku. Are you with Ansem? You are half correct. Let us say that he is not the Ansem with which you are familiar. He is Ansem, and he is not Ansem. Perhaps a nobody best conveys the idea. Riddles were never my thing. Try again. He belongs to neither the light nor the dark, but walks the twilight between. <laughs> Catching on now? Oh, yes. You also stand in between the light and the darkness. It appears we have much in common. Maybe. Like you said, there really is darkness left inside of me. But so what? Darkness is my enemy! And so are you for reeking of that awful smell! Oh, ho so it's a fight you want. Very good. I shall take you on. Huh. 
What if it's more things? Huh? Goofy was telling us about another castle we'd been to, but none of us really remembers it. Do you think? Could it be that we don't remember because we're losing our memories? Losing our memories? Hold on. Remember what that mystery fella said? In this place, to find is to lose. And to lose is to find. It must have been our memories he was talking about losing. So if we keep going, we'll lose more. Guess it really is Castle Oblivion. So the higher we go, the more we'll forget? Does that mean everything and everybody will be forgotten? Riku, and Kairi too. Do you want to go back? Don't worry, fellers. We might forget about where we've been or what things we've seen, but we won't forget who our friends are. I don't know. Come on, Sora. When you turned into a Heartless, did you forget about me and Donald? Of course I didn't. There you go. No matter what happens, you won't forget your friends. Oh. You're right. Thank you, Goofy. So if there's nothing here that can make you forget about your friends, then we have nothing to be scared of. Let's go! But when I turned into a Heartless, who was the one who took forever to notice and kept clobbering me? How come you couldn't forget about that? <laughs> <laughs> I find coursing through you there is a darkness of formidable power growing, well worth the trouble of aggravating you. All this excitement has provided me with invaluable data. What? <laughs> Many thanks, Riku. It was a trick all along. What's happening to Sora? Namine's powers are being used to shuffle his memories as we speak. Marluxia may well succeed in getting his puppet. Sora would be a valuable asset to the organization. But Marluxia and Laxine's actions, they... leave me quite uneasy. And then there is Axel. Who knows what that one is thinking? Vexen should take care of this. His replica is soon to be completed. But Vexen despises Marluxia. Think of the mess it would make. So we must tell him. Isn't it better that Vexen clean up the mess than leave it to us? You seem pretty intrigued by this Sora kid. Are you telling me you're not, Larxene? <laughs> Haven't decided yet. I think what intrigues me more is what you see in him. There was a time he became a heartless, and if one becomes a heartless... They lose their minds and their feelings. They're consumed by the darkness. Right, but not Sora. He held on to his feelings even as a heartless. And there's only one other man who's been able to do just that. It's the strength of his heart. 
That's what interests you. Why the Keyblade shows Sora's heart. To unlock the mysteries of the heart. Isn't that the organization's mission? <laughs> oh, I wonder what your favorite thing be for that Hmm, if we did, what would it have been? I can't think of anything, so maybe that means that I really am losing my memories. But whatever they were, they couldn't have been very important memories, right? Right. Or else I don't think you would have forgotten it. Look. What is that? A good luck charm Kyrie gave me. It's special to her, so I promised that I would return it. I'll never forget making that promise. It's why I could never forget Kyrie. Am I right, Kyrie? Do I know that girl? Hey, Sora, where did you go? Sorry, never mind. We better keep going. Huh? What are you supposed to be? Surprised? I guess you should be. After all, I look just like you. I'll tell you what I am. I'm an exact replica of you that Vexen made from your data. So you're a fake me. Not a fake! I don't care if you're real. You're not better. We share the same body and the same talents. But... There is one easy way to tell us apart, though. Unlike you, I fear nothing. Are you calling me a coward? You're afraid of the dark. The darkness inside you still frightens you, no matter what you say. But I'm different. I embrace the darkness. I can make it do whatever I want. So, I can wipe the floor with you. that have been before in my memory it wasn't Kyrie but another girl 
Maybe... I think her name was... Sarah! Yeah. Let's go! The one to find Rico and the pig don't know. Um, sure. Man, it was right on the tip of my tongue. I remember. Huh? There was another girl. What? A girl? Where? No, no. I mean on the islands where I used to live. Besides Kairi and Riku, there was one other girl I was friends with. The four of us played together all the time. Sora? Seems to me that's the first time you've mentioned her. Yeah. I guess I forgot all about her. I think... She just suddenly went away when I was still really little. What do you think makes you remember that now? I'm not sure, but it's been coming back in pieces as we go through the castle. Gorse, do you remember her name? I don't remember. I feel kind of dumb. We said we weren't going to forget our friends, and well, now I can't even remember her name. Sora! Oh, you shouldn't be worrying none. If it's been coming back to you in pieces, you're sure to remember her name just like everything else. Hmm. Hey, fake! I thought I heard you say you were gonna wipe the floor with me. <laughs> Don't forget I'm still new. I'll get stronger and stronger. The next time we fight, you're finished. Then let's fight now! <laughs> it's nice having darkness on my side. You are so missing out. How could you be scared of something that can be so thrilling? Enough! <laughs> so now the coward is playing tough. So long, real thing. Hope you don't miss me. Come back! <laughs> no way. I'm not a coward. Just bits and pieces. Maybe you could try telling us some more stuff about her. Who knows? It might even help you remember other things. Well, uh... She was quiet and always drawing. When we'd go to the beach, She'd draw a picture instead of swimming. Sometimes she'd draw us, too. She was really good. <laughs> I remember Riku and I fighting over who she'd draw next. But one day, she was gone, just like that. I think the grown-ups knew the reason. They might even have tried to explain some of it to me. But I was little. I probably didn't understand what was happening. I remember crying after she was gone. But that's all. I still don't remember her name. Oh, I bet you'll remember it in no time. 
Ah, I must point out, Sora keeps remembering things instead of forgetting them. It seems to me, forgetting things may be the only way to reach the memories buried deeper down inside each of us. So we should forget in order to remember? Like those guys said, our most precious memories lie so deep in our hearts that they're out of reach. All that stuff about finding, being losing, and losing being finding? I didn't get it at first, but maybe this is what they meant. Gore, Sora, I think I'm a little jealous of you. How come me and Donald and Jiminy aren't remembering more of the stuff from our memories? Come on, Goofy. Let's get going. We gotta forget things faster. Just as we intended. We'll continue with our plan. Let's see how far this group will go. You had your fun on the first floor. So this time, it's my turn. <laughs> I'm not going to just give it to him. Don't break him. Well, do I detect a soft spot? I'm not going to break the toy. I'm not dumb. Don't forget. Sora is the key. We need him if we're going to take over the organization. I know that you're in on it too. But keep it under your hood. At least until the time is right. You would have been wise to have done the same, Larkseen. <gasps> I bet you want was actually. Too clever. I'm Larkseen. So, are you enjoying your stay at the castle? I bet it's nice to peel away all the worthless memories and awaken the true memories. <laughs> that lie deep in your heart. True memories? Although, it seems that you're still forgetting the most important thing here. When that poor girl hears that you've forgotten her name, why, it'll just, it'll break her heart. Poor girl. Do you know her? <laughs> is she... here? Yes, she is. You see, the bad guys are holding her captive somewhere deep inside the castle. And you obviously are the hero, so you have to go save her. Although... I'm a bad guy, so you have to go through me. Sora! What's that? Is that thing mine? What a shame! You've been wearing it all this time and forgot? No. That's not possible. The memory has to be engraved somewhere deep inside your heart. Sora, you think carefully now. What, oh what, could it be? And who gave it to you? Nah. Nah. Meh. Sora, Sora. You're getting it now. Release the memory from within your heart. Nomi... Nominate. Well, it's about time. That's right. Nominate. Yes, she's the one that gave you that tacky little good luck charm. 
Not that you even bothered to remember. No surprise, seeing as you also couldn't remember her name. <laughs> Talk about heartless, I can't believe you. It'd serve you right if I decided to smash this piece of junk. Let it go! Nominate gave me this. It's very important to me. Oh, it's important to you. Ten seconds ago, you didn't even know what it was! So, how was the real thing? He's spineless. In no time at all, I'll be better than him. In the meantime, would you be interested in meeting another who's considered a hero? You mean Sora. I hear he's somewhere in the castle. You want me to take care of him? We'll see, yes. I intend to make good use of you. No worries. The real Riku is nothing. Sora won't be either. They're no match for me. <laughs> You're not as bad as I thought. You really are a hero. A heartless hero. Who asked you? Oh, does it hurt because it's the truth? You are just a baby. And if you're gonna be a baby, then here you go. I created another card from your memories, you know. Be a good boy and say thanks. Ta-ta. Wait, Luxine! Where are you? Don't you dare hide from me! Show yourself! Sora, calm down. She's not coming back. Sora? I hate this. Why'd I need someone like that to bring back... Naminé's memory? Whew. Throwing that battle wore me out. Really? It looked to me like you just plain lost. Ye How dare you! You don't appreciate the nuances of- An ungainly huh? effort. Vexen? 
How could you be humbled by someone of such limited significance? You shame the organization. <sighs> How can we help you, Vexen? It's not very often we see you topside. I came to lend you a hand. You obviously believe this Sora has much potential, but I remain unconvinced he is truly worth such coddling. I think an experiment would show if he really is of any value to us. <laughs> well, here we go again. It's just an excuse so you can carry out your little experiments, that's all. I'm a scientist. Experiments are what I do. Yes. Whatever. You can do what you want. But you know, I think testing Sora is just a cover for testing your valet. Valet? He's the product of pure research. What he actually is, is a toy. Hmm. You should just learn to be quiet. Anyway, since you came all this way, you're gonna need this. A humble gift to my elder. I hope you use it to put on a very good show for us. That card holds the memories of Sora and Riku's home. It's just a card. What good is that? With a little help from Namine, you'll have all the real Riku's memories. Maybe we can get her to make you forget you're nothing but a fake. In other words, we'll remake your heart so you can be exactly the same as the real Riku, okay? Oh. You want to remake my heart? The real Riku is a wimp who's afraid of the dark. What do I want with the heart of a loser? Any objections, Vexen? After all, you do want to test Sora, don't you? It must be done. How can you? Are you betraying me? I told you I would make good use of you, didn't I? No! Relax, kiddo. I don't think it's gonna hurt that much. <laughs> I'll hurt you! Ah! Ah! Stupid little toy. Think you could defeat me? Where would you ever get a thought like that? <laughs> but look on the bright side. Along with everything else in your head, Namine will erase the memory of me knocking you flat. Instead, she will implant the loveliest little memories you could ever hope for. It's no big deal that they're all lies. No. <laughs> no! No. You're... Riku. No. What are you doing here? Not happy to see me? Let me know if I'm getting in the way. You know, of something that's more important. Uh-huh. I didn't mean that. <laughs> Spare the excuses. I bet that you had all but forgotten about me. Are you crazy? Come on, I came all this way looking for you. But you're not anymore, right? Now it's only Namine that you're looking for. You don't care about me, just like you never cared at all about her feelings. Nominees? <laughs> I knew it. Never even gave it a thought, did you? Just cause you want to see Namine. Sorry. Doesn't go both ways. Tell you the truth, Namine doesn't even want to look at your face. Why not? You should ask your memories. Why Namine disappeared from the islands. Remember that. And you'd know. Did I... Did I do something? I is it my fault? Riku. Go home, Sora. I'll care for Namine. Anyone who goes near her... Goes through me! What's... what's wrong with you? We're supposed to be friends! Please, Sora. 
Since when have you ever cared about me? Namine's not the only one who's sick of looking at you. So am I. <laughs> Riku, stop it! Yourself, fake. fake? Fake? Oh no. no. That's not exactly the right word. What are you saying? Isn't he just a copy of me? More like a model. He is an example of what you should try to be. He accepts the darkness. Just like you once couldn't help but accept me. But now you are afraid. Perhaps you are the one who is being fake. Fake when you pretend to have no fear. When have I been afraid of the dark? Inside of the card worlds. You grapple desperately with the darkness. Desperation is fear. You fight the darkness because it is what frightens you. I... Be quiet! Stubborn boy. Then continue your fight if you must. Eventually you will learn. You cannot resist the darkness. Sora? Are you okay? Don't worry about me. Riku... What happened? Hmm... Sure was strange. Almost like Ansem was back, controlling Riku again. But we got rid of Ansem for good. Then I wonder what is wrong with Riku? Hold on! The kid! If he's with Riku, he might be in danger. Sora? I know. You're thinking Riku isn't your friend. But that's just not true. You sure? Well, I know he said some awful things to you back there. But you gotta remember, we are in Castle Oblivion. Why folks lose their memory here a little bit at a time. Riku's probably just forgotten that the two of you were such close friends. That's all. So he just forgot? My guess is that's so. But Sora, instead of being sad, we have to figure out a way to help Riku get his memory back. If we all work together, why, we're sure to get you through this. No need to mow. Jiminy's right. You shouldn't push your friends away. Yeah. Okay. So, uh, do you remember our very first promise? Huh? Always smile. smile. That was the promise we made to each other the first time we met. We promised to never forget to keep smiling. 
You're right. Take the hint. I told you to go home. Not until I rescue you and Naminé. I don't remember ever asking you to rescue me. Did you forget? Kyrie's there, waiting for us both to come home. You're the one who forgot. I told you at Kingdom Hearts when we closed the door. Take care of Kyrie. <gasps> Give it up. I'm not going back to the islands. For anything. It's not just for Kyrie. What about the rest? You can have those losers. Already forgot them. That's enough. What about you, Sora? Do you actually remember what they all look like? Of course I remember. <laughs> Don't feel bad. That's what this castle does to you. After a while. It's good. You forget all the useless stuff and remember, for the first time, what really matters. I remembered it, Sora. I now know the one thing that is most important to me. Protecting Naminé. Nothing else matters. Not a thing. I think I'll jog your memory. <laughs> Go ahead and try. Too bad, Sora. You can fight me all you want, but I still won't remember a thing. Come on, Riku. Let's quit fighting. Let's go help Naminé. Together. Right. So like you. Sora, you're always trying to worm your way into my heart. Hold on. When did I ever do that? Huh. You forgot that too? You never cared. It never mattered to you! You won't push me away. Does it hurt, Namine? Watching your two childhood friends fight, all because of you. You have my sympathies from the heart. But don't waste your time. We nobodies can never hope to be somebodies. I don't get it. Riku and I, 
We both want the same thing. Both of us want to help Namine out. How come we're fighting each other? I mean, Riku and I have argued about stuff in the past, but... Could be, because you care what happens to each other. Hmm. I really thought so, too. But... Maybe Riku doesn't. You can't give up your friends. Time together. Shara, Riku, and... And... What's her name? Hmm. It seems our memories are fading mighty fast. Sora, we gotta hurry. I bet Riku will come around if you just talk to him. You're right. We three were never apart. Me and Riku and Namine. So what's going on, Vexen? Your Riku was supposed to counter Sora. What's he waiting for? Where is he? He's hiding somewhere to lure Sora deeper into the castle, right? I suppose we should just leave it at that, you know. Aha! Oh, I see now. I would have never guessed that. So sorry, Vexen. Silence! Predictable response. Forget it. Men without hearts are so boring. You're one to talk. As if you have such a heart to speak of yourself. That's enough. Marusha. Vexen, the simple fact is that your project was a failure. You'd best not disappoint us again. Disappoint you? You go too far! In this organization, you're number 11. I'm number 4 and I will not have you! <gasps> I've been entrusted this castle and Namine by our leader. Defying me will be seen as treason against the organization. Traitors are eliminated. I believe that's what the rules say. Who needs a half-baked good-for-nothing anyway? <gasps> Vexen, you cannot win against Sora. Pity to be so ignorant. As you're only able to see the surface of things, I should not expect you to appreciate my true might. Oh? Then let us watch as you prove it. What? None of us wish to be suspicious of a comrade. Your insincerity is comforting. You give a challenge like that to Vexen and he'll... seriously want to eliminate Sora. That would be an unfortunate denouement. What to do? Your hero is soon to be wiped from existence. But I believe there is a certain promise that he made you. Isn't that right, Namine? Yes. And that must mean we've lost ten whole floors worth of our memories. Sora, it's still not too late. Don't you think we should turn back? Can't do it. Because that would break an old promise that I made. An old promise? What would that be? On the islands, I promised Namine that I'd keep her safe, no matter what. But I forgot it. I didn't remember until I started forgetting everything else. A promise between the two of us. That's why I can't leave. Now that I remember the promise, I have to keep it. Of course. We understand, Sorrow.
Who are you? I am Vexen. I have come to collect your debt, Sora. A debt? Sora, do you owe something to this guy? Come on, of course not. Oh, but you do. You owe me for reuniting you with your former friend. No. You don't mean... Indeed, I do. I'm the one who brought Riku to you. Then... You're the one... You're the one who's been controlling him! What have you done with him? I see no need to give you information about where Riku is. After all... Why trouble you in your final hour? As I expected, you weren't one to die very easily. As if I'd ever lose to you! I wouldn't be so sure. Did you even notice? I was delving deep into your memory as we fought. And here, look what I found. A card crafted from all the memories that are locked in the other side of your heart. Wait! Memories? In the other side? If Sora disappears, that would mess up the organization's plans. I trust that you know what you need to do. Haven't a clue, really. Maybe you could spell it out for me. Vexen has clearly committed a treasonous act against the organization. You must eliminate the traitor. No taking that back later. A card made out of memories from the other side of your heart? Hmm, I wonder what it does. We'll find out soon enough. It's the only one we have left. No other way to move forward. What's wrong? Something feels really strange. I'm sure I don't know this place, but it's starting to feel like it's familiar to me. You must have come here sometime before. No, and that's what's strange. It could be like with Nomine. You forgot lots of other stuff, and that's why you remember this place now. No, it's different. With Namine, my memories sort of came drifting back to me, a little piece at a time. But not now. It's not memories, just this idea that I must have been here before. So, <sighs> feeling nostalgic? Sora, a question then for you. Your memories of Namine or your feelings here? Which of the two of these is more real, I wonder? Namine, of course. Whatever it is that I'm feeling, I bet it's just another one of your mean little tricks. <laughs> the memory's wiles can be cruel. 
In its silence, we forget. In its obsession, it binds our hearts. Cut the riddles! I told you. This place was created solely from another side of your memory. It is on the other side of your heart that the memory of this place exists. It is your heart that remembers. You're wrong! I don't know this place! If you remain bound by the chain of memories, and refuse to believe what is truly found inside your heart, then throw it away. You are not a Keyblade Master, just a slave to twisted memories. Yes, exactly like my Riku. Your existence is worth nothing! Like your... Riku? Worth nothing? That's enough! You're the one who changed, Riku! Every word you've said is a lie! I'd never throw away my heart! I'm gonna take you down and save Riku and Naminé! That's... what's in my heart! Why so glum, Naminé? Is there something that's been troubling you? Are you feeling awful about tinkering with Sora's memory? Or maybe you... Cut it out, Larxene. Naminé? She doesn't want to remember Sora. Is that so? Don't worry. Whatever's hurting you, I'll make it go away. I swear it on this. The good luck charm you gave me. See ya. That's just amazing. It's almost like you completely made his heart from scratch. Nice touch with the good luck charm. I didn't know you could use memories to transform objects like cards into keepsakes. You used the same trick on Sora, right? You changed Kairi's good luck charm with your magic, didn't you? <laughs> it won't be long before Sora forgets about Kairi completely, and then he'll be all yours to- He won't forget. Huh? No matter how much I change his memory, Sora will never forget Kairi. Memories of me... More false memories of me... Will just make his feelings for Kairi even stronger than before. Because... I'm the shadow of Kairi. What's your problem with that? That should be your incentive not to screw anything up. Just do a good job rewriting Sora's heart... Then you can actually be somebody, and no longer just Kairi's shadow. You'll be real in Sora's heart. <clears throat> you have such strength, even at the mercy of your memory. None of that matters. Just put Riku back. <laughs> just put him back? The Riku you speak of has but one fate to sink into the darkness, and you will share that fate, Sora. If you continue to seek the girl Naminé, 
The shackles will tighten. You'll lose your heart. And end up becoming Marluxia's pawn! Marluxia? What does Namine have to do with... Ugh. Uh, Axel! Yo, Sora. Did I catch you at a bad time? <laughs> Axel, why? I came to stop you from talking too much. By eliminating your existence. No! Don't do it! We are just nobodies who have no one to be, yet we still are. But now you can be nothing instead of just being a nobody. You're off the hook. No! Please don't! I don't want to... Goodbye. What are you? What are you people? Don't know. I wonder about that myself. <gasps> Vexen is no more. Yes. His scent is gone. Axel struck him down. Something I find deplorable. Agents of the organization striking each other down. Our problem is Sora. Vexen proved to be no match for him. Yet he's still under Namine's control. But we cannot eliminate Sora, can we? Correct. For our superior, he is in dire need of the Hero of Light. When Light loses sight of its path, we may find use for the dark. What we must do is obtain the darkness. Riku, of course. Nice work. I say good riddance to that blabbermouth. Marluxia. You used Vexen to test Sora's strength, didn't you? Not just Sora's, it was yours too. We weren't sure if you actually had it in your bones to take out a fellow member. Well, I guess that you did. It's time to join up. Taking over the organization will be like child's play with the three of us. So that's where Sora comes in. Of course. He wants to see Namine, so why don't we just give him what he wants? Rejoice, Namine. The time is near for you to meet the hero that you've been longing for. I'm glad. But I'm warning you. You better not do anything to betray Sora's feelings. Do you understand me, little one? I understand. All you need do is layer Sora's memories and bring his heart closer to you. Sora. Even if you come for me, what then? Oh, Riku! You'll hurt Namine if you go further. Uh, you still want to fight? But Vexen's gone, so now you're free! It doesn't matter what happens to him. I'm protecting Namine from you. That's what's in my heart. Sora, I made a promise to Namine. I promised to keep her safe. You did? There was a meteor shower. This one night when she and I were little. Oh. Namine 
got scared and said, what if a shooting star hits the islands? So I told her, if a shooting star comes this way, I will protect you. You made a promise with a toy sword. What? How do you know about that? Because that was the promise I made to her that night. I would protect her. I said it. Don't lie. You weren't the one there that night. You're the one who wasn't there. That was when she gave her good luck charm to me. Her what? See? Uh, tell me. Where did you get that? Sora. Good try. Huh? That must be a fake. I've got the real one right here. Well, two of them? Fake should be destroyed! It's just like mine. How'd he get this? It turned into a card. Sent. You're another one of those nobodies. You've done well thus far. But to possess your powers and yet fear the darkness, what a waste. I do not fear it. I sense that you do. You're also capable of controlling the darkness. Cast away your useless fear. Open your heart. Embrace the darkness. And if I say no? Then you lose both light and darkness. And disappear. <laughs> I, Lexius, will not yield to the frail heart of an infantile coward. Now, stop resisting. And let the darkness in! Uh, I don't understand what's going on. 
Let's just keep moving, okay? It doesn't matter. It does matter. How can two of you have the same memory? You can't both be right. I'm wrong. Fine, then don't believe me. That's not what he meant. We're just kind of worried. Then let's ask Namine. That should clear it up. Look, we don't have time to sit around, so let's go. Sora, what happened to you? What's that mean? Well, you always get real touchy when it comes to stuff about Namine. But before we came to this castle, you didn't even remember what her name was. Now Namine's the only thing you talk about. It doesn't make sense. Maybe you should just slow down and think ahead about some of these things. Think ahead? What is the matter with you guys? Do you want me to abandon her? No, that's not it. Then do whatever you want. You can lay back and take a nap for all I care. I'm going to find Namine. Sarah! You're all that he's got left. So then, if you don't stop this, no one will. But I... it's too late. You shouldn't give up just yet. Say, Namine, have you noticed Marluxia doesn't seem to be around. What are you... saying? Just that there's no one here who would want to get in your way. <laughs> Just make it count. Now this... should be interesting. Try and make it enjoyable, Sora. It's the least you can do for me, you know. <laughs> oh. Hey, wait. I'm enjoying this. You guys are something else. The island! You're finished! Don't mock me! You were too much trouble. Too slow. You are the superiors. Forgive me, Zexion. This was a fight I should not have started. <laughs> okay. I have to keep her safe. Namine! Can you hear me? Oh. Namine! Sora, you really came for me. It's you. It's really you. I've been through so much just to see you. Yes, I wanted to see you too. But this isn't right. It must stop. 
I wanted to see you, but this isn't the right way. Namine? I was lonely for so long. I just couldn't bear it anymore. So I called out to your heart and had you come all the way out to this place. You came for me, and I'm so, so happy, but... But to your heart, I had to. Don't worry. I'm here because I promised that I would protect you. Sora. Thank you. And I'm sorry. I'm not supposed to be in this picture. That's true. Ugh. Nominee? That isn't me. I'm not there. I don't really exist inside your heart. I don't exist in anyone's heart. I never have existed anywhere. What? What are you saying? What's gotten into you? Weren't we inseparable? Always together? But then you had to go away. I came here so I'd never lose you again. Was it really me you wanted to see? Of course it was. I know I've forgotten a lot of things in this castle, but never anything about you. <sighs> Look, you gave this to me, didn't you? You have it. My good luck charm. No, Sora, you can't believe me. What am I supposed to do? Think, Sora. Think just one more time. About who's most special to you. Call out to that piece of memory. That glimmers faintly deep inside your heart. No matter how far away the light gets, your heart's voice will always reach it. Who's most special to me? <laughs> That's an easy one. It's you, Namit. Namine! It isn't you. The person most special to me. It's not you, right? No. The girl you really care about. The one who was always with you. It's not me. It's her. But then who... who is she? Because I can't think of her name. If she's so special to me, then why can't I remember? Because... I went into your memories and- Let me explain this. Huh? Plain and simple. Your memory is a train wreck. You're not the one who's meant to protect Naminé. It's supposed to be me! But you and your messed up memories are always in the way. Sora! I see you now, clearly. Huh? Lexius? Riku, I can see your heart. No, it's not. Darkness this foul could only, only be. That's it. Remember me. Let me drift into your heart. Ansem! <laughs> you called out my name. You have been thinking 
about me. You're afraid of the darkness I command. Good. The more you think of me, the closer my return draws. And when I have awoken, I will take hold. Your heart will be mine! Want some more? Ah! Sora! Uh, uh, Riku. Looks like I win. Riku! Stop! You are through! I said stop! Riku? Riku? Riku! What did you do? What did you do to him? Broke his heart. I'd say more like she smashed it, really. Smashed? His heart? Then, what's gonna... what's gonna happen to Riku? <laughs> oh, you're so much fun to watch. If it's a Riku you're worried about, then don't. Because Riku was never really here. What do you mean? Do you really think I'm just gonna say it? That's too easy. <laughs> oh, what to do? Quit the games! <laughs> uh. <sighs> All right. Have it your way, then. I know it'll kill you to hear this. But I think I can live with that. That thing lying there is just a puppet that Vexen made as an experiment. No more than a toy. It's laughable, really. It called you a fake, but it was the fabrication all along. Not Riku. A fake? Fake in every possible way. It was only finished recently. How could it remember anything? You get it? Its memories with Naminé were just planted, not real. Yep, that means all this time it's been picking fights with you over memories that were counterfeit, trumped up, and completely bogus. Isn't that the truth, Naminé? Oh, so cute. But behind this little face, you do awful things. <laughs> Naminé? You're so stupid. Don't you get it now? That's what Naminé's powers are about. She can enter, rearrange, and even create new memories of anything, even things that never happened. The girl you've been trying to protect all this time is really a manipulative witch who shackles people's hearts. Uh, then... my memories... are all... Oh, you do get it. Lies, lies, all lies. Just Naminé's illusions, nothing more. Binding you in the chains of your own memory was central to our trap. It makes me tingle to think how easily you were duped. So close to it, we were almost there. This was our only chance to turn the Keyblade Master into our puppet, but that jerk Axel, he used Nominate to betray us. <sighs> so now, I'm left with no choice but to eliminate you. You'll pay. Don't! Huh? It's a little late for the witch to grow a conscience. Last time I checked, 
you're the one who fooled around with his memories, creating this mess. I know, but... I should tell you that I'm in an extremely foul mood. Thanks to you, all our plans are ruined! <laughs> Nominee! What's this? Are you upset? <laughs> and you don't even actually know her. Maybe not. But still, I made a promise. What? A promise I made to Namine to keep her safe. Maybe my memories are fake, but the promise is real to me. That's why I'll keep it. <laughs> You're such an idiot. There is no promise, and there never was. You're just delusional. Must you insist on playing the hero? Huh? Whatever. If that's the way you want it, you're going down alone! <laughs> what if we just trap you? Huh? Donald! Goofy! You found me! Of course we did! We were worried about you! And we promised! We promised that we would protect you! You won't ever be alone. It's always been the three of us, and we stick together. And that is how it's going to stay. Okay. Have it your way. More pain for you means more fun for me. Must be nominate. It's good to meet you. We're friends of Sora's, and my name is. You're Goofy, and you're Donald. Yeah, but how did you know that? Congratulations, Sora. You finally found your friend. I'm so happy for you. Gee, there sure are a lot of questions. Nominate, I know this probably won't be easy for you. But could you tell us what happened? Of course. It's my fault, after all. I took the people and memories that were inside Sora's heart. And little by little, I replaced them with false memories. Hey, what about Sora's promise? Made up. It was fake. Sora never really promised me anything. Me being with him on the islands... That was a lie, just like everything else. We never met. I was never Sora's friend. And you were never anything more... either. No. You see, in all of your true memories, I was never really there. Gee, then that must mean it was your magic that made the rest of us lose our memories, too. Is there any way for us to ever get them back? I can fix everything. If we go to the 13th floor. But 
Marluxia, he... Bet I know who that is. Was he the fella who made you tamper with all of our memories? If I didn't obey, he said I'd be locked in this castle forever. I've been alone for so long. So you did what he told you to do because you were lonely? I'm so sorry. Don't be. Please don't cry. Oh. Of course. I know I really don't have the right to. That's not what I meant. What? It's like this. I'm really not happy about you messing with my memories. But, you know, I can't really get mad at you for it either. These memories you gave me. In my head, I know they're lies. But they still feel right. Like the promise I made. I said I would protect you, and that I wouldn't make you cry. Not ever. Namine, if you cry now, I'll feel guilty, like I let you down. So don't cry. Please. Until I get my memories back, smile and try to be happy. It's easier on me that way. Sora. Brother, that's a bit much. It's okay. Sora always gets like this every time he's around a girl. Aw, oh, cut it out. I thought you both lost your memories, too. <sighs> too bad. Good friends don't forget the good stuff. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> there. That's it. That's the nominee I remember. Yeah, I really liked it when you used to smile. Of course, that was really only in my fake memories. But what I'm feeling now definitely isn't fake. It's real. Thank you. Well then, let's go. Oh boy, I can't wait to get my memory back. Nominee? Marluxia is gonna be up there, so maybe you'd better stay down here. Yeah. Maybe you could look after Riku? We'll come get you when it's over. Okay. Please be careful, Sora. I'll be okay. I promise. Who was it? Who's most important to me? Nothing. Can't you remember? No, I only remember Namine. Come on, do you guys remember anything at all? <sighs> no, sorry, Sora. It's important. But I just can't remember. I don't want to be. But I'm getting scared. Then we should really make a promise. Huh? What you said back there kind of got my brain uh, thinking. Whenever you make a promise that's super duper big, maybe it gives you the courage to face the scary stuff. Courage. Yeah, let's do it. Even if we get scared, or in trouble, or even if we get separated. Or even if we sort of forget each other. Whatever happens, we're friends. All for one and one for all. You have some nerve to show your treasonous face around here. Some nerve indeed. Treasonous? I don't know what you could possibly be talking about. Why let Namine go? 
If it weren't for your needless meddling, we could have turned the Keyblade Master to come and serve us. Oh, right, your big plan. You use Namine to rewrite Sora's memory piece by little piece, and he turns into her total puppet. Then, using Namine and Sora together, you and Larxene overthrow the organization. Am I right? I would say that you are the traitor, Marluxia. Since when were you suspicious of us? Do either one of us have the heart to believe anyone? Hm. So you only eliminated Vexen to obtain proof of our plan. That I didn't want to do. But it was your order. Oh. Remember the order. You must eliminate the traitor. I always follow orders, Marluxia. Larxene paid the price for disloyalty when she disappeared. You must do the same! <laughs> The organization's betrayed. In that name, I will annihilate you. That line's not you. Well, had to try it once, you know. Hmm. <laughs> Is that your shield? Won't do you any good, I'm afraid. I wonder. Are you listening, Sora? Oh? Axel says he's willing to harm Namine to get me. You won't let that happen, will you? Oh, come now. You're Marluxia's puppet already? After I finish you, he's next. Hmm. <laughs> now, Sora, we've got more in common than you might think. I'd really rather not fight you. But I can't dishonor the organization, now can I? The king. He protected me. Your majesty? Where are you? Please answer! You're with me, aren't you? You're better than I thought you'd be. It was worth saving you after all. Saving me? What do you mean? <laughs> Sorry, I would hate to kill the suspense. Axel!
Lexius is gone as well. Vexen, Larxene, Lexius. I wonder who will be next in line. I thought perhaps it might be you. Me? No way. I already took my pounding from Sora. He thinks I'm done for good. No, I think it'll be Marluxia next. For defying the organization and targeting Sora. I hope he moves exactly as his heart commands him to. So, what about you? I thought you guys had plans for Riku. Yes, we were going to set him off against the traitors. But with Marluxia gone, there is no more need. He is nothing but a nuisance now. And he's dangerous as well. After all, he took down Lexius. You know, that is not how I do things. Tell me, did you obtain the data on Riku's home? You've defeated Axel. <laughs> the Keyblade's power. How I've longed to make it my own. Let Nominate go! You've no chance of winning. Nominate, erase Sora's memory. <gasps> but if I do that... That's right. Sora's heart will be destroyed. His heart destroyed? You can do that! I'd rather have preferred him unmarred. But he can be rebuilt, more to my liking, with time. Namine, do it. No. Sora forgave me even... when I deceived him. So how could I destroy his heart? There's no way! I don't care what happens to me. I won't hurt Sora. I won't do it! Then you will. Do it, Naminé! <sighs> I don't care. You can erase my memory. Sora, why'd you say that? Because who will I look after if I don't have Naminé? So just do it. Erase my memories. Destroy my heart. I promised. I'll always protect you. You have to believe me. Sora. I don't need any memories to take on someone like Marluxia. You bet. Even if Sora forgets it all, you and I won't forget. Donald's right. He and I can remember everything for Sora. See? I'll have all my friends' memories, so I can piece my own together again. You ignorant fool. If Namine uses her powers to erase your memory, you'll be nothing but an empty shell. Your heart will no longer be able to feel or to care, just like Vexen's pathetic imitation of your Riku. Take another guess. <laughs> what? Ah! It can't be. Riku! No. Just an imitation. <sighs> You're a shell. A shell who has had everything taken. Everything! What can you possibly think I ever had? Both my body and my heart are fake. But there is one memory I'll keep, even if it's just a lie. Whether it was a phantom promise or not, I will protect Namine. Imbeciles. You would knowingly shackle your heart with a chain of memories born of lies? You would be one who has a heart, yet cast aside your heart's freedom? You turn from the truth because your heart is weak. You will never defeat me!
You could say that. <laughs> However, what you destroyed was merely an illusion of me. So what? <laughs> Another imitation. He's really in there? Yes. I knew it. I can feel his power. It's trying to destroy my heart. Gorge! We'll just take care of him together! Sure! Come on! Riku, protect Namine. You don't mind? <laughs> Should I? All right. Soon the emptiness will shatter your heart. Here in this world of nothingness. Lightless oblivion devours you. Drown in the ever blooming darkness!
What? One of the senses died. A really strong one. Huh? The keeper of this castle, Marluxia, has just been felled by the Keyblade Master. Keyblade? You mean Sora? Sora is here? Yes. Want to see him? But... Can you face him? What's that mean? The world of darkness and and some shadow still nest within your heart. Do you plan to face Sora like that? Are you not ashamed? <laughs> Sora's fate is to battle the darkness. He must oppose anyone who hosts the dark. In other words, it's you. If you don't believe the words I say, then you had best see the truth with your own eyes. This card... This is our... Yes. It is your home. You okay, Riku? Not Riku. I'm a fake. I can't remember why I was created or where or when. All that's inside of me is time with you and Namine. But I know those memories are not real. Gee, Namine, can't you use your magic to put Riku's memory back to normal? It's all right. I'll deal. Wait! Who cares if someone created you? You are you and nobody else. You have your own heart inside you. Those feelings and memories are yours and yours alone. They're special. Sora, you're a good guy. I don't have to be real to see how real your feelings are. That's good enough. Riku! Riku. This is... that night! All of the islands you grew up on were sundered, scattered. Many hearts were forever lost to the darkness. Because of what you did! <clears throat> you hated being an islander, so you opened the door to darkness and destroyed the islands. It was you! You were pulled into the darkness then, and now you belong to the darkness. You should look. Look at what you truly are! Can you bring our memories back? Yes. Not remembering something doesn't really mean that it's gone. What do you mean? When you remember one thing, that leads to remembering another. And then another, and then another. Our memories are connected. Many pieces are linked together, like they're in a chain that makes up each of us. I don't actually erase any memories. Just take apart the links and rearrange them. You still have all your memories. So you can put them back together? Yes, but first, I have to undo the chains of the memories I made on my own. After I've done that, I have to gather up the memories scattered across each of your hearts, and then reconnect them. It might take some time, but I think it might work. 
No. It will work. I'm sure. It's my turn to look after you. All right. We all really trust you. Oh. Wait a second. You said you'd have to undo the links of the memories you made. But that means... Yes. You won't be able to remember anything... about what happened here. Not even you? I'm sorry. It's the only way, I'm afraid. Sora, you have a choice. You can lose your memories of this castle and reclaim your old ones, or keep your memories here and give up the memories that you've lost. Do I have to... to choose? Yes. Sora, it's me. Oh, what? Stop it, Sora. Don't you recognize me? Yeah, I recognize you. I can see exactly what you've become. Yeah! How can the light hurt you? Riku, have you really become a creature of the dark? You're not Riku anymore. You're just a pawn of the darkness. So be it. It's time for you to face the light! Fading. Fading away. Into the light. You won't fade. You can't fade. There's no power that can defeat you. Not the light. Not the dark. So don't run from the light. And don't fear the darkness. Because both will make you stronger. Make me stronger? Darkness too? Yeah. Strength that's yours. The darkness inside your heart, it's vast and it's deep. But if you can, truly stare into it and never try to look away. You won't be afraid of anything again. All this time I've tried to push the darkness away. You've got to just remember to be brave. Know that the darkness is there and don't give in. If you do that, you will gain strength. The kind that's unlike any other. You'll be able to escape the deepest darkness. And I'll be able to see through the brightest light. Follow the darkness. It'll show you the way to your friends. Can I face them? You don't want to? You know I do. Of course. And I will. With my strength. My dark strength. Darkness! Even the light can't block the smell. 
I guess I followed the darkness right to you. This is absurd. Then I shall make you see that your hopes are nothing. Nothing but a mere illusion. Not anymore. <sighs> What is he? No one's ever won the darkness the way that he does. It's impossible. <gasps> oh. oh, yes. The replica, of course. We can use this Riku to defeat the real one. Axel? Wouldn't you like to be real? All you need is the kind of power that the real Riku doesn't have. If you can get that, you can be a new person, not Riku, nor anybody else. You won't just be a copy of someone, you will be unique, your own self. Axel, what are you saying to him? You know, he's as good a place to start as any. You can't do this! No! 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 So sorry, Zexion. <laughs> you just found out way too much. Riku. Riku. Who's there? I know you can feel it. The grip that I have on your heart. <gasps> you have led in the darkness, Riku. That means very soon your heart shall become an all-consuming darkness. I'm not like that now. Yes, you are. <gasps> Can't move. The deeper the darkness runs inside you, the stronger I become. Controlling you is effortless. <laughs> Must you interfere again? <sighs> Ooh, sure glad I made it in time. Ought to keep Ansem busy for a while, huh? Sorry I couldn't come here sooner, Riku. Your Majesty, is it you? Uh huh. Whoa! <laughs> that tickles. <laughs> this time you're not an illusion. I'm so glad that you can make it here. I made a promise to you that I would find a way, didn't I? Oh. Ah, uh, I'm okay. Don't worry. Guess I'm just relieved. I've... I've been alone so long. But having someone else around is... is a little... overwhelming. But, uh, how did you make it here? I thought it was too far. I found a card to help me. I needed a way out of the realm of darkness. And then suddenly this card appeared right in front of me. When I picked it up, I could see your heart beyond the darkness. That's what let me find you. I guess the card thought its place was to be with you. Maybe you are right. Make me like I was. Oh. Okay. Nobody needs to keep a bunch of memories that aren't real, right? You want to remember all of the people 
who are really important to you. Anybody would choose that. Where am I? What is this place? Oh, your majesty? You must battle me all alone. Against my dark powers. <sighs> What's this? Are you giving up? Finally ready to surrender to your fate? You're not the true Ansem. Oh. Mm. Your scent is different. The Ansem in my heart smells darker. The odor is more foul. But your scent just isn't that. It's not darkness. It's something else. I finally understand. You're the one who guided me when it started. You came to me pretending to be Ansem. You gave me the card to make me face the darkness. Hmm. That, that is, is correct. correct. Diz, or so I am known. You, I've watched you all along. Really? Who are you? And what do you want from me? For you to choose. Choose? You are a special entity. You exist between light and dark. You stand in the twilight. You are to meet Namine, then choose. Namine? Who's that? You will know soon. <gasps> Maybe Namine is here. Hold it! <gasps> You've changed your own darkness. It doesn't frighten you anymore. How can you tell? Because I'm you. No, I'm me. I'm me, he says. Must be nice being real. A fake like me could never get away with saying that. That's right. I'm a phony. A fake! The way I look, the way I feel, everything I remember! And even... this newfound power! Huh? I thought by finding some new strength, I could finally be someone... someone who's not at all you! But... nothing changes. I'm still just empty! Everything about me is borrowed. As long as you're around, I'll never be more than a shadow!
To remember again, we have to keep in that? Yes. It's going to take a little time, but I'll take care of you. Gorsh, when we wake up, we won't remember who you are anymore. But how are we going to thank you? Don't worry about that. I'll just make a big note in my journal. And it will say, thank nominate. Oh, good. That makes me feel better. Well, good night then, Nominee. Good night, Goofy. You too, Sora. Okay. All of this may have started with a lie. But I really am glad that I can meet you, Sora. Yeah. Me too. When I finally found you, and even when I remembered your name, I was happy. The way I felt then, that was no lie. Goodbye. No, not goodbye. When I wake up, I'll find you. And then there will be no lies. We're gonna be friends for real. Promise me, Naminé. You're going to forget making that promise. If the chain of memories comes apart, the links will still be there, right? So the memory of our promise will always be inside me somewhere. I'm sure of it. Yeah, you're right. Okay, it's a promise. Good. Until later. A promise. Huh. Sora, some of your memories links are deep in the shadows of your heart, and I won't be able to find them. But don't worry, you made another promise to someone, who you could never replace. She is your light. The light within the darkness. Remember her, and all the memories lost in the shadows of your heart will come into the light. Another promise. Look at the good luck charm. I changed its shape when I changed your memory. But when you thought of her just once, it went back to the way it was.
Kyrie. My friends. Namine? Don't worry. You might forget about me. But with our promise, I can come back. A promise is a promise. Yes. One day, the light. It will be ours, and it will bring us together. Till then, I'll be in your heart. Right. Forgotten. But not lost. So, it's over. <laughs> Death doesn't frighten me. Good riddance to a phony life. My heart was never real. I'm sure even what I'm feeling now is probably all fake. What are you feeling? What happens when a fake dies? One like me. Where will my heart go? Does it disappear? It'll go somewhere. Maybe... to the same place as mine. <laughs> A faithful replica until the very end. That's... okay. Are you Naminé? Yes. I see. That was you. Huh? Forget it. Nothing. Please, come this way. Huh? Sora! What have you done to Sora? Nothing. He's just asleep. To get his memory back. So, Sora chose to forget about this castle, and get his old memories back? You have a choice to make, too. Why me, too? No one's messed with my memories. It's not your memories. It's your darkness. In your heart there is darkness, and in that darkness is Ansem. He may be at bay for now, but eventually he'll wake. And he will take over you just like he did before. But I have powers you can use. With my powers, I can put a tight lock on your heart. That way, Ansem could never come out from inside you. What happens to me if I let you do that? Will I forget? Everything? Like Sora? I'll have to. The darkness in you will be sealed tight just like your memory. You'll stop remembering the darkness. You'll go back to how you were. Riku, please choose. He doesn't even look worried. Will I sleep like that too? Yes. Figures. Sora always did as he pleased. Whatever we'd be doing together, he'd find a way to slack off. Even trying to leave the islands. I did all the work on the raft by myself. That's it. When this slacker wakes up, I'll tell him off. I told him to take care of Kyrie, and here he is just taking a nap. But I can't chew him out like he deserves. If I've been asleep. <laughs> I don't need my heart locked. I'm ready. I'm gonna fight Ansem. But what if his darkness overtakes you? If that happens, 
Then the darkness will show me the way. Yes. That's true. <laughs> Why do I get the feeling that you knew I would say that? I didn't know. I hoped. I wanted you to face the darkness. Because... You're the one who can. So that's the reason. That's why you came to my rescue inside that light. In the form of Kyrie. When'd you know? I knew when I met you. You and Kyrie smell the same. Look after Sora. Gosh, I guess you decided not to go to sleep. How'd you know that? I heard it from Diz. <gasps> Do you know him? Well, I'm not sure. Got a feeling that I've met him somewhere. Hey. Who are you? I could be nobody, or anybody. It is up to you whether you choose to believe in me or not. Boy, you really like pushing decisions on other people. And you have pushed away slumber, making the choice to face Ansem. Do you think I'm reckless? You have chosen your own path. Are you supporting me? Or are you abandoning me? That will be your choice as well. What's this? The organization will pursue you. Like a pack of hunting dogs, they will sneak up on you if they sense your presence. However, this cloak that is worn by nobodies will render their eyes and their noses useless. The ears, not so. They wear this to give themselves protection from being devoured by darkness. Is it clear? Even the organization cannot rule the darkness. Doesn't matter. I won't run from the darkness. Hmm. The card will draw out your heart's darkness. Finish your business with Ansem. Come on. Let's go. He said this card will draw Ansem out. Don't worry. We can defeat him together. Sorry. I've got to face him alone. But why? There's no point in doing this if I can't do it on my own. But I do need a favor. If Ansem is the victor, he is going to enslave me. If that happens, use your powers to destroy... Of course! I'll be right there to save you. Huh? No, th that's not it. I want you to destroy... No way! No matter what happens, I'm gonna be right there to help you. I promise you that. Unless you don't believe I'll come through for you. I choose to believe in you. Always, Your Majesty. And I in you. You're not gonna lose. I know it. Thanks. Ansem! Where are you? Show yourself! <laughs> Why in such a hurry? I'll be here at the very heart of darkness. Watching you plunge into the same darkness inside of you. 
I smell you, Ansem. Show yourself! I have watched you fight. I know your strength. Your skill with darkness has grown. It has become more mature. And yet, why? Why do you accept the darkness? but still refuse me. You know you and I are similar. We both follow where the darkness leads. Indeed, we are the same. So why? Does some part of your heart still have a fear of the dark? That's not it. The truth is... I just can't stand your foul stench. You are a fool. You should know my power as well by now. Yeah, I know. Or did you forget? I used all the power you had to give, and Sora still beat me. I'm not at all impressed with your powers. Very well. In that case, you shall sink into the abyss! This is... the end. This... is hardly... the end! Your darkness... I gave it all to you. My dark shadow lingers. Someday... Someday... I will return! Sora. Kyrie. Gosh, Riku, I know you wanted to do this alone, but you don't mind getting a little help, do you? So, Riku, what happens next? Are you going home? 
I can't go home. Not yet. It's still here. It's really faint, but I can sense him. So, I think his darkness may still have a hold on me. Your darkness belongs to you, just the same way your light does. Up till now, I thought darkness was something that should never exist. Then, I spent time with you and changed my mind. The road you chose, I didn't know. Light and dark, back to back. With you, I think they might meet in a way nobody's seen before. Wonder where that road leads. I'd like to see myself. I'd like to walk the road with ya. <laughs> Your Majesty, I'm really flattered. I don't know what to say. Gosh, Riku, you know you don't have to call me that now. We're pals. Fair enough, Mickey. What are you making me choose now? Between the road to light and the road to darkness. Neither suits me. I'm taking the middle road. Do you mean the twilight road to nightfall? No. It's the road to dawn. <laughs> 